Hi, good afternoon. I'd like to welcome you to Palm Praise too. I do thank you for tuning in and peace and blessings be upon you and your family this afternoon. Now we are going to get right back into the African American poetry. Right now we are on a meditation for my son. Now there is the picture. Do you see it? Okay. This is the second poem by Atha Michael Weaver, 1951 until. Now, for my father's first baseball game, that was for David. Now, a meditation for my son is for Kala. I wouldn't say Kayla. It's K-A-L-A. -A. So, I'm going to pronounce it. Kala. And without further ado, it goes as such. Weaver seems to suggest that the speaker in this poem cannot always control his mind and his life. In such times when he feels he is mentally ill, he hopes and prays that the spirit of his ancestors will protect his child from danger. When I go spinning, your care is given to the still nerves of reticent angels or reticent angels. Excuse me. When I cannot hold my own heart drops away. Some sure finger from a faded portrait follows. You in the thorn filled curves of a man's road. When I cannot dream, I pray in blind rooms that possible colors and bodies will converge around you. Set you sailing over rocks, away from the soulless. When I am not whole, I entrust you to seraphim in their difficult dominion and the definitions in this poem is uh, reticent shy soulless without feeling uh, Sarah or seraph a kind of angel and dominion a band of angel so I do Thank you for tuning in for this poem, A Meditation for My Son. Stay tuned for Poem Praise 2, the next upcoming poem, It Be It Thy Will, that I will have for you, is The Poet by Lucille Clifton. So for this afternoon, I want you to be well, take care. And peace and blessings be upon you and your family. If you like, hit the like button, share, and subscribe. Then you'll know when I'm coming to you here on Poem Praise 2 with the next poem, The Poet. So until next time that I speak to you. Take care, okay? Till next time. Later, y'all.